Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today we're gonna to take another look at another 2022 Department 56 piece, and this one is going to be the uh, Lit Ghost Billboard. You talk about nostalgic. I love these billboards, uh, and Department 56 has released many over the years. They always seem to sell out. They eventually come back into stock usually, but they're very hard to find. And if you look at the secondary market on eBay and Macari and OfferUp, you'll find that once they go out, uh, they go for crazy amounts online. So with that, let's jump right in and look at the 2022 Lit Ghost billboard. Okay, so here is the billboard. It's uh, it's lit up, it's plugged in. Now this comes with a battery pack, but uh, for all the crypts and the accessories that take power, uh, you can usually use the uh, wall plug adapter from Department 56, and that's what I'm using today. You can kind of see that uh, there behind it. It's a three-prong uh, adapter that uh, can power three three different accessories at the same time. But uh, So here it is lit up. Uh, it looks certainly better uh, in a dimmer light and at night, and it, I know it's difficult to see because of the... Uh, the way the lights are, but this says a Grimsley Manor, which is incredibly cool. It's the uh, one of their uh, earlier production runs of a very cool mansion. I know many of you have it. Um, I certainly have it. I told you in the review that I actually have two of them. I like it so much. and So I like the way that they've actually put Grimsley Manor on here. And then the ghost and the boo... Uh, happy Halloween, open late, and fun for the whole family with a lit jack-o'-lantern and some fall leaves down at the bottom. So just a really, really cool uh, piece. I love this. It's very nostalgic. I already know that for uh, for my setup this year for 2022 in Manor Row, I'm going to put this because that's where I have Grimsley Manor. And so I've got the pumpkin patch in the middle, and what a what a better way to advertise kind of the Halloween party or something going on at Grimsley Manor. So this is a perfect uh, sign, and I knew that as soon as I saw it, uh, I wanted it, and I knew exactly where I was going to put it. So if we take a look around the piece, uh, it's typical, you know, Department 56. We've got a little dot on there from something. It doesn't belong there. It's coming off, though, so no, no worries. Uh, if you look at the back, you can kind of see how they, they ran the wires up uh, up the back and uh, onto the lights there. It's cool paint and cool finish on the back of the piece for the uh, the wood look. Uh, and then obviously we come around to the, the front again. The other side uh, looks just like uh, this side. So not a big piece per se. I mean, big enough. It's really nice uh, and very colorful, very nostalgic looking with the ghost and just the lettering that they've they chose to use to uh, to put onto this um, billboard. So very very cool piece. Uh, if you want this this year, this will this will set you back sixty five dollars. Pretty pretty average, I guess for for a lit sign. Uh, not too too bad. Uh, and if you're into the the billboards, I know like I said they've released several. Uh, you're definitely going to want this one into your collection because it's a pretty it's a pretty cool and very nostalgic piece. So. Hopefully that gives you a better idea of what this uh, looks like and what it looks like lit up. Uh, and so, yeah, good piece. I'm glad I got it in my collection. Well, hopefully that gives you a better idea of what the lit uh, Halloween billboard or the lit uh, ghost billboard looks like for 2022. Very cool piece. Again, if you collect the billboards, you're definitely going to want to get this one. More than likely will sell out. Uh, I know they have in the past. I searched for the uh, pumpkin patch billboard for the better part of two years before it ever came back in stock. Uh, outrageous prices on eBay. I was very tempted to pull the trigger a couple of times, and I'm glad that I held off because they eventually, it has not been retired, so they eventually got around to producing them again. I got one at my local Hallmark store for absolute retail price, and at that time, I think it was still $50, $50 or so. So, I think it's a worthwhile investment. I think these will sell out uh, at some point. And uh, I don't know that they're going to retire this piece. We won't know until the uh, the end of the year when they announce the retirements. But uh, good piece to have in your collection. And hopefully that gives you a better idea of what the, 
the fit and finish looks like and how, you know, the size wise and maybe an idea of where you can use it in your village. So, hey, if you've liked the review video, please, as always, uh, give me a thumbs up and, uh, and like the video. It certainly helps the channel out if you do that. And also, if you, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, consider doing that. The channel is continuing to grow. Um, the, the more subscription I get, the more uh, humbled I am, first of all, but also the more empowered I am to continue to do this uh, and answer your questions like I always do. So if you have questions, please leave those in the comments. Very nostalgic day today. We started with a billboard. We're going to take the next review video and look at a couple of uh, nostalgic signs that Department 56 has released this year. So uh, with uh, that'll be in the next video you get to look forward to. With that, take care of yourselves and we'll talk to you real soon.